edible glitter trend all over the internet, and it's certainly one of my new favorite trends in cakes. And here to show us how to make it is the one and only king of cakes and star of Food Network's Cake Masters, Duff Goldman! How's it going? Hey guys. I'm excited that you're here. You too. This is your kitchen. Yeah. This is Brandy's kitchen. Yep, it's my kitchen. I like it. So you're I gonna like give it. us all your secrets to making glitter cakes. I'm gonna give you some of my secrets. Kind of business to run, you know what I mean? <laughs> We're gonna make some really cool stuff. We're gonna do some little hearts, we're gonna mm -hmm. do some flowers, and then I have a humongous surprise for you, and I'm not gonna tell you what it is yet. It's amazing. I love surprises! Okay, you're gonna love it. You I, ready? I, I'm pretty sure you're gonna love it. Let's do this. Okay, let's do it. So okay. where do you find this edible glitter? What does it look like, and is it safe? You can find it online, you can find it at cake shops. You're not gonna find it at like the grocery store, but it is totally safe. Edible glitter, like you're gonna eat it, you're gonna eat like that much. And it tastes, like, tastes like anything. It's just, it, yeah, it's totally fine because I love all the it's colors a highlight. It comes in. That is just like Harry Potter magic. We're gonna make little edible hearts. Now these hearts here, these are made out of gum paste, right? Okay. Which is like fondant, except mm -hmm. it gets really hard. We're gonna glue these to little sticks and then we're gonna oh, stick them into the gosh. cake. So when you first get gum paste, it's gonna be white, okay? Got it. And feel it, it's like real stiff, right? Really hard, yeah. really stiff. Then what you do is you take gel colors, right? Not, and tint it. Not the liquid colors, the gel colors, the really strong colors, and you tint it, right? So you just put the little drops in there, you knead it, and then boom, it becomes whatever color you want it to what be. What I love about making just tiny little decorations for cakes is you can make like a basic plain cake and then use these to decorate. Right. See, this is the kind of stuff I like to do with my nephews because it's fun. It's like playing yeah. with Play-Doh. Okay, so okay. a little bit of cornstarch, yep. right? Just so it doesn't stick to the table, it doesn't stick to the rolling pin, and then you roll it out. So we got these little cutters. I love hearts, this is great. Okay, so let's talk about your show because we are so happy that we are mm. gonna be able to watch you on Food Network. So Cake Masters uh -huh. is a lot like Ace of Cakes, but it's here in Los Angeles. It's a whole new staff. We have cakes that shoot fire. We have a, a cake that transformed. He's like And then he goes back We had a, wow. a cake of a monster truck that shot mud. Yeah, we put a real <laughs> engine in it and then the tires spun. Oh my God. 130 gallons of ganache. I stood behind it with my mouth open. <laughs> I mean, Duff, if anyone can <laughs> handle requests like that, it's you. Thank you. How do we get the glitter onto the hearts? You have to get this somehow sticky, and then okay. you have to somehow get the glitter on it. I'm so show you we should method. lick the hearts. Don't lick the hearts, no. Here's what we're gonna do. Let's stick this on here. Uh-huh. All right, and now we're gonna get vodka. It makes something wet, but then it evaporates really fast. Do so, we take shots of the vodka before we decorate? I mean, I would I would wait till you decorate. That way you don't run out of vodka. You can put it on a paintbrush, uh -huh. and then, are you right-handed or left-handed? Right-handed. Right-handed, so I'm gonna put this. Okay, close your fingers really tight. Now, I'm gonna do the same thing. Oh my God, are we blowing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my Ready? God. This Look. is awesome. So how long does this take to set? It's probably gonna take about an hour. And how far in advance can you make these? Like a couple weeks? You can or? make these six months in advance. Gum paste doesn't go bad. Okay, so this is- What are is, these little guys? This is royal icing. The man has bags of tricks upon tricks. Flip these over. Okay. You take your goo. Yep. All right, you just kind of give yourself a little oh, line. Okay. Like that. Okay, press it down. Like that. This is so beautiful. <gasps> oh my goodness. Okay. So here's a whole forest of them. And it's stunning. I mean, the presentation yeah. is amazing. You just have the little skewers there. We know how to do the hearts. Mm -hmm. Now you're going to show us how to make glitter flowers. Yes. For beginners, what kind of flower do you recommend making? We're going to do a really fun one. You can do this with five year olds. This is fondant. Okay. Okay, so you're going to take a ball, just kind of warm it up a little bit. Take a pen, let's move this out. Okay, pick a circle. Give me the other one. All right. You want to do multiples of three. So you go one, two, three. That's one. One, two, three. Okay. Save okay. this for later. Save that for later. Now, grab that vodka. You, you can either take the brush or you can just take your finger. Either okay. one. You're going to go one, two. Not this one. So one, two. two. So a little dot. And then overlap. Overlap. Okay. Overlap. Very gently press it down. Flip it over. Whoa. Okay, and you want this one on the bottom. Okay. Roll it, roll it, roll it. Hold it up like this, and then you just start gently pushing in. Gently, gently, gently. It blooms, and then you get two. This is like a magic, oh my god! 
That's what I was doing. My mind's being blown right now. Yeah. A little twist. Mm -hmm. <gasps> then you just keep going. Oh my God, I feel like we're on The Bachelor. Will you take me notes? These are so <laughs> cool. Take a flower. Okay. And just get those edges. Oh, so just gonna have a kiss of glitter. <laughs> oh my gosh, this yeah, is perfect! Good. Yeah. <laughs> Glitter is so much fun. It's so much fun. <laughs> okay, here's a cake. Okay. Wait, what? And then, here's a cake. These are beautiful. Thank you. Wow. Okay. This, this is, is like a marble It's cake. really easy. You take some white fondant and some okay. pink fondant. You kind of mash them together. But don't mix it too much. Don't mix it too much. And then you roll it out. And actually, we hung out with you before. So if you want to learn how to layer cakes and wrap cakes in fondant, check out that video too. Before you stick any of these in here, okay. think about where your sign is going to go. So Got I'm going to basically put my sign like right here. Oh, this is facing you? forward. already so pretty. Okay, so then we're going to carefully place on top. Where is this flower going to go? Cut it on an angle and then just a little bit, like say right here. And you can stick them here, you can stick them on the bottom, you can stick them on the top. This is beautiful. I feel like they're just missing something. What's your favorite animal? My spirit animal? Mm -hmm. My spirit animal is a unicorn. Why? Right, my favorite animal is American buffalo. <laughs> oh my god! And there's a little baby one. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, I'm gonna cry. I'm okay. gonna cry. But here's the thing, you're making my cake, so here's buffaloes. Oh, they're best friends. <laughs> okay, these are all these are just fondant. So no, just fondant. these are just magic. Oh they're magic, but yeah. <laughs> nom 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 nom. Kisses, kisses, nom. Poor dog. He's galloping. And then should the baby be on this side? I don't want him to feel lonely. This is the most ridiculous cute cake I've ever seen, ever. Look at this thing. More Look ridiculous than my buffalo oh, cake? My buffalo. This is so adorable. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is amazing. Duff, thank you so much anytime, for being here. Anytime, anytime. Oh, this is the best day ever. <laughs> I am so excited. I know you guys are gonna have so much fun making your own cakes. And don't forget to tune in to Cake Masters Mondays at 9 on Food Network. And if you enjoyed this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe to Pop Sugar Food. We'll see. Okay. No!